So one thing I am terrible at, and I'm not really ashamed to admit it, is independent rolls on marimba. I basically can do it with my right hand without even thinking about it, sort of like how my right hand is good with tambourine shake rolls without even thinking about it. But my left hand, when it comes to independent rolls, I can sort of do like singles, like bing bong, bing bong, bing bong. But as I speed up, it just sort of gets out of control and doesn't sound like anything. So I am fortunate enough to know Eric Odaimo, who is this international marimba superstar. She's playing concertos with orchestras and she does solos and recitals all over the world. She was in New York so I asked her if she would come and explain how to practice independent roles on marimba. So here she is. Eriko, thank you so much for coming. It's my pleasure. Good to see you. We are in the glamorous Metropolitan Opera percussion yes. room as you can see. Um, it's lined with red velvet. Oh wait, this is kind of a gray plastic <laughs> thing. You are a world famous marimba player, glamorous and uh, international superstar. Is that accurate? Thank you for being so nice always. <laughs> I have a problem on marimba mm -hmm. and I have a lot of students who have the same problem mm -hmm. and I have no idea. I can't play independent roles with my left hand. Well, I can play with a little bit with my right hand. I don't really know what's happening. I can kind of do it, like check it out. See, it happened, I don't know. I didn't really practice it. Then with my left hand. Like if it's at the perfect speed, then it sometimes happens, but then I can't trust it and um, it basically sucks. Oh no! <laughs> so what do you think? I'm not satisfied of my technique, so, but I can absolutely give you some advice. I personally don't like to have too clean one hand roll because that sounds like just a rhythm for me. Yeah, and sounds like machine gun. Exactly. In general, when I play, I think of four mallets as a four different voicing ah. with a different instruments. Yeah. So when I do roll, I don't think of the I'm doing one hand roll. Okay. Have to be fast or clean. Okay. No, I just sing separately. Uh, you know, then sometimes end it by I'm doing maybe one hand roll sometime, but sometime together, you know. Yeah. When you have to do some one hand roll like physically, do you practice in here all the time? Yeah. That's wrong, I think. Oh. You can practice anywhere. Yeah. So first forget about having mallets, just move your hands. My hands are different, like my left hand does like smaller shakes and my right hand kind of does the rotation. Okay. So what should my left hand do this? Do okay. like this? So you can ask your friends to move your hands, then remember how ah. your muscles are moving. Okay. And ah. when you open the door, that's the same moves when you do one hand roll. I'm right handed. Yes, so you can use left hand from now on. So I should practice with my left hand? Yes. When you are taking a shower or waiting for subway anytime, you can just do the, 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 what is 120 tempo? Ah. So you're doing quarter notes in at 120? Yes. And then eighths? Eighth. And then Eighth note triplets, and then sixteenths. Yes. Or you know, you could just go to a door and just do that yes. with the handle. <laughs> yes, maybe annoy some people, but <laughs> <laughs> you could practice at the hardware store. Oh yes, exactly. Yes, good one. You have a limited time to practice on marimba yeah. physically, right? And you want to practice more melody line too. What what kind of exercises could you do if you wanted to practice at a marimba? So you can pick any your favorite code. First, you need to pick some code okay. for note. Maybe this. Ah. So you same thing. To, you know, make sure you are controlling. Yeah. Yes. Then once you did that, that's, then finally you can just... Your examples are so much nicer than mine, by the way. <laughs> That's not need to be like... Ah. Like make it faster, slower. So you're really focusing on the sound of the drone. Exactly. Instead of the speed or the, the mechanical motion. Exactly. So could you practice like different speeds maybe like... Yes, 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 yes. 
feels a little better, but not that great. Yet. No, it's good. If you practice only left hand, sometimes it's very difficult for you or for myself too. So to get an example of the speed or sound, I practice both hands together sometimes. Like. Just to recap, once you come to the marimba, after you've been practicing on your own, first make sure you're getting the resonance, you're getting the right sound. Practice going slow to fast, and practice both hands at once because you, you can mirror your left hand to your right hand. Is that exactly, right? Exactly, okay. yes. Any last tips for us? As I said in the beginning, just sing separately, this sound. Sometimes, um, to get the example, if you have a, just this note for the one hand, then I pray for both hands to make sure what kind of I'm looking. Then I remember, then started left. You learn the concept of the sound by playing yes. with two hands. Yes. And then you try to match it with one, with one hand. Exactly, yes, yes. Wow, these are great ideas. You know, I wish I had some ideas like this when I still was practicing marimba. <laughs> you still practice marimba. <laughs> that's true, yeah, that's right. Yes. Thanks so much to Erico. I also want to know what kind of independent roll exercises do you do? I need some ideas because I still have to work on it as you can see. Let me know in the comments below. Also, Erico asked me to say she is sponsored by Marimba One and uh, Vic Firth. So shout out to those guys. And if you're a company who wants to sponsor the show, reach out and let me know. I also wanted to mention that a lot of people have been asking me about my snare drum setup. What kind of drum do I use? What sticks do I use? What kind of moleskin and muffler do I use? I put it all together into this PDF called the Audition Ready Snare Setup. All of that information with pictures and everything at robnopper.com slash gear. If you like this video, hit me with a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to this the channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Erico, you sound so amazing on Marimba. So oh, where are you playing? When can we hear you? How can we find out the details? This season I'm playing next week in Hong Kong as an orchestra, a Marimba Concerto by Pius Cheng. Then I'm premiering Pius Cheng Percussion and String Quartet piece in Eugene, Oregon in yes, May 16th. Kagoshima, Japan in May 28th. Kagoshima, where you're from? Yes, okay. where I'm from, Wind Ensemble Orchestra, that's a concerto. Then I will have another concerto in Vietnam in June 4th, Vietnam National Symphony Orchestra. I will have a vacation in Ireland. Can we all come? Yes, of course, okay, please. Cool. I'm doing a jury at the International Marimba Competition, actually Universal Marimba Competition in Belgium, 2017. Ah. Okay. That's starting July. I'm doing a jury member, then I will have a recital on August 1st. Thank you so much. Thank Appreciate you very much, it. Rob.